Hi, I'm Aj and welcome to Tea Break Tips. In this video, we're going to be showing you three different ways to mount your Lavellia microphone using our Invisible Lav Covers Original. These mounts are great for when you're working in particularly tight spaces and you need to achieve the utmost transparency possible using your lav mount. It's very important to make sure that you prep your microphone before you get to set so you can mic up your talent as quickly as possible. So I have a beige invisible lav cover here. I'm gonna pop the microphone so it sits just in the middle of the pre-cutout window of the tape. And push that down hard to make sure it's secure. I'll then take the original, ensuring that the, the larger holes of the mount remain facing up. I'll press that down on the sides of the tape. Press it down so it's nice and secure so your mic doesn't fall out. And what this does is it keeps a nice space of dead air around the mic's capsule. And there we go. Now we're ready to go to set. And now we're ready to mount our mic on our talent. So I'd like to introduce Caleb here. Hey, Ed. Hey, Caleb. I'm going to be micing you up today. So if you wouldn't mind, if you could just lift your t-shirt up. Sure. Thank you very much. Peel the backing paper away from the tape here on the mount. Nice and easy. I'm just going to mount the microphone right in the middle of Caleb's sternum. Sorry, Caleb, I'm just going to press quite tightly here. No problem. Thank you. Excellent, so that mount is nice and secure now. So what I'm going to do is take some tape to secure the cable to the side of Caleb's torso, as such. There we go, I'm just gonna pop that on the side there. That should be okay. And if you can pull your shirt down again, please, Caleb. Thank you. Sure. And there we go. As you can see, the, the mount is very low profile. It's almost impossible to see under Caleb's shirt. Yep. And yeah, how does that sound, Caleb? Uh, does it feel testing good? one, two, testing one, two. How does that sound? Yep. Yeah. And if, if you move around a little. Reach for stuff. Excellent. Shouldn't touch the table, but yeah. And that should be some nice, clean, easy audio. Thanks, Edge. Thanks, Caleb. So if the talent is wearing a shirt, a really nice way to use the originals is to mount the lav mic in between the shirt seams. Thank you, Caleb. So I'm just going to, as before, remove the backing tape from the mount, as such. And for extra transparency, I'm going to mount it with the microphone capsule facing outwards. There we go, Caleb, if you wouldn't mind doing your shirt up again, please. So we use the beige invisible lav covers to closer match with the costume. So let's hear how that sounds. That's how it sounds. Testing one, two, bubble bee, bubble bee, bubble bee, bubble bee, bubble bee. Hi, how are you doing? Okay, and hopefully that sounds fantastic. Thank you very much, Caleb. Thanks, Ash. So another really great way of mounting a lav mic in a shirt using the originals is to, what we're gonna do here is we're going to move the backing tape, such, and we're just gonna fold over the top edge of the cover, like that, encasing the capsule. We're then gonna place the capsule on this side of the shirt seam, and we can move it a little closer to the seam on this side. Just pop that in place there. This mount sounds really great, and it gives you a little extra protection from very low winds or plosive sounds from your voice. And it's also an excellent mount to use in the brim of the hat. So we just have a listen to that. Testing one, two, testing one, two, three. How does that sound? Hi, how you doing? Okay, and hopefully that sounds great. Thank you very much, Caleb. Thanks, Edge. Thanks for joining us on another tea break. Really hope you found some of these tips useful. If you did, please don't forget to like, follow, share, and subscribe. And if you require any more information about our products, please visit bubblebeeindustries.com. Have a windy day.